So hi everybody. I am wearing Fancy's outfit today to manifest. Just so we're all on the same page. I actually don't know if Persona 3 is going to be announced at the Xbox showcase. I'm just making the very, very, very educated guess. <laughs> like I could be a fool right now for all I YouTube. No. I'm just really excited to watch the Xbox showcase today. If they announce the Persona 3 remake here, I'm manifesting FemC as much as I can. I might be a real big fool here, but doesn't mean I can't like try, right? Uh, will it happen? Probably not. Like, I'm just gonna be completely honest with myself. It probably won't happen. My expectations are here. Okay. Yeah, I, I do. Oh, oh God. <laughs> Oops, can jump scare. I'm assuming like 95% of this, I'm not gonna care about. I will be genuinely surprised if I do. I'm not an Xbox gamer, man. <laughs> Sorry. P3 remake and SMT5 on Game Pass. That's my other thing. That's the only two predictions I got here. Let's do it. Oh my God. <laughs> Dave jump scare. What do I think about heroes? Well, Hello, Dave. About Starting off the Xbox the showcase real strong with Every, Dave here. On the agricultural side of things. That is a giant pumpkin. Around mythical creatures. <laughs> and that's what they are. I'm here to conquer the vegetable. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of like Dave. This is the age of innovation. This, if you will. Is this like is Jack the and the Beanstalk? Vegetable. But Dave and the Beanstalk? Dave and his Beanstalks. That's, that's what this game is. <laughs> Oh, oh, it, Fable, that was my second guess, obviously. Glasses? <laughs> Big game tours. Oh, God. I'm liking the aesthetic of whatever this is. Look at that hip sway. Damn. Oh, that's cool. Oh, whoa. Okay, not gonna lie, that kinda look cool. The Empire? Oh, oh. That looks like some They're Star right Wars shit to me. I'm sorry to you Star Wars here. fans. I'm not a huge Star Wars fan myself. I never could get into this series. Gameplay walkthrough reveal. Okay, so they have a walkthrough, gameplay walkthrough reveal later. Wow. Dude. Okay. Fable, South of Midnight. Wow. Star Wars, followed by a deep dive into one of the most important RPGs <laughs> ever made. Starfield. Wow, Gaming that's a statement. Bitch, have you fun. never played any other RPG? That is by partnering with the most ambitious wow. of game creators. These are the works of the very greatest creative She's teams pretty, from though. around the world. We made this show for you. She you made this show for me. The, the way she directs her gaze at the camera, it looks like she's world staring like premiere. straight into your soul. There is no camera. She just sees right through your soul. Oh, this is cute. See, this is what I'm talking about, showing gameplay. 33. That's a, <laughs> that's a co-op, man. Funny to think that this game thinks I had 33 friends to play with. Oh, <gasps> I'm immortal if I play? Oh my God, <laughs> Jesus, that's Everybody so <laughs> hit the floor. Gun. Dramatic music. More gun. More gun. Payday 3. I didn't even know that Payday 1 and 2 existed. I don't know these games. I've heard that they have guns, though. World premiere. World premiere. <gasps> ah! Oh my god! Ah! Is it happening? Wait, is this it? Is this it? Ah! Oh my god, it's real! <laughs> YouTube. That guy, why do they put Kenji of all people in the trailer? Oh my, oh god, there's, ah, uh, the UI. Oh wait, they like Persona 5 did. <gasps> what? Oh, uh, information overload. I don't even know what that word means. Holy shit. Persona 3 reload. Wait, that's it? That's the whole ass trailer? That's it? No! <laughs> so short! <laughs> 
YouTube. Oh, wait, no, stop. It looks like they Persona 5 to the game, as in like the, the style. Starting off with like, I guess reveals. Oh my God, wait, wait, wait. Remember how like whenever I met I guess for the first time, my first comment was that she was a giraffe because her neck was like abnormally large. They fixed it. I guess is no longer a giraffe. Oh my God, an actual map. Being a map God, cool. Oh my God, all the new sprites, Jesus. Wait, we got like new scenes in general like this is a kitchen dorm be looking good look at polonia mall though Ugh. i feel like they made kenji look like even more of a douchebag than he was before i don't know his last sprite was like he just like comes across as a douchebag but like his new model like looks even more douchebag <laughs> oh oh wait it was like a split second of the of the cheekbones yeah, the cheekbones. They still cut a bitch, guys. <laughs> as long as they don't take away Kurosawa's cheekbones, I'm happy. Yeah, they. it feels very like EY, like Persona 5. I love it. Oh, Yukari looks so good. Wait, so this is Tartarus then. 123 floor. Jesus Christ. Still like all the old enemies. That menu transition, hello. I could like just replay that. Like look at this menu. Oh my God, the splash of the water and... Oh. <laughs> that's a... Ooh, that's a, that's a sexy menu. Holy shit. That's it, that's the whole last trailer and it's early 2024. But I didn't really talk about the music because I'm trying to look at everything visually. Oh my god. If I get more music. <laughs> Dude, Lotus Juice is popping off, man. I am all for more banger soundtracks, man. Holy shit. All right, we'll move on with the rest of the Xbox showcase. I'm sure actually that might be the only thing I care about, but I'm just going to keep watching. <laughs> I don't know, maybe they actually do announce SMT5 on Game Pass. That's my other prediction. Other than that, I don't know what to expect out of this. Investigate some play. God, my heart's racing. It it's hard to move on from that. Holy <laughs> shit. <so> Avowed. <laughs> Female chorus vocalizing. <laughs> it just, uh... That looks like a game. It looks like the game of all games. Oh! Wait! Oh, this is Sea of Thieves, Welcome but... To the scum bar, Wait, the most notorious Monkey Island, isn't that like a really YouTube old game? I'm not gonna lie, I, I kind of want to play it. <laughs> not this collab, but like, I don't know, just Monkey Island. Yeah, I've heard that the game is a classic. I remember hearing about it whenever I was a kid, because it was around the same time that I was playing um, a lot of King's Quest. Swelling music plays? <laughs> what does that mean? Flight simulator. Oh, man. I thought for a second that this, whatever that cargo boat was, I thought it was just holding a bunch of Legos, like gigantic Legos. Mountain rescue, oh my God. I can, I can rescue the mountains? I can race in the air, which turns off my swelling music, sand. So is this like a Dune crossover? Okay, that's actually pretty cool. <laughs> I can see that being pretty hype if you were like a, a fan of these kinds of games. I will not let them down. She is ready. They know. Shit. Go. Oh! Oh, hell. Who are these around you, Sarawa? Those you have saved. Shit. That was pretty hype, actually. Waves <laughs> crash. <laughs> Oh my god, Barbie the video game. I don't know. <gasps> oh, wait, what? Get the YouTube. Down! Uh, 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 no goddamn way! <laughs> YouTube. Wait, that's not like a Dragon 8. This is 8. Okay. <laughs> you could advertise your game in any way you goddamn want. And you choose to advertise your game with a naked protagonist. <laughs> Words cannot describe how much I fucking love RGG Studios. 
This is the best. I love them so much. Like a Dragon 8 was the last thing I expected to see, man. The 8 was balls the whole time. Jeez, that was definitely a shocker. Answer the call of Vault. Answer the call of Vault. Answer the call of Vault 76. That, oh. Play it now with Xbox Game Pass. <laughs> okay, that's a great ending you got there. Uh, okay, this is a little bit creepy. For being really creepy though, it's really oddly colorful. <laughs> Japanese style music playing. <laughs> Ew! Okay. Ah! That seemed intri- okay. Path of the Goddess. I might play that. We'll see. I might play it. It looks cool. I'm always down for new General IPs, Motors man. General iconic brands. Chevrolet, Cars. Duris yeah, V8, man. And hybrid power. Cars go vroom. Proud to usher in a new era of competition. Ooh. With the innovators Drama. The new. Vroom. Very vroom, much wow. I don't understand how you could make a car commercial like that go as long as it did, because cars all do the same thing. They just go vroom. You're just watching different ways of going vroom for, you know, a couple minutes. Vroom. And, and look, vroom from this angle. Vroom. I have seen all that ever was and all that ever will be. I have seen betrayal. Bitch, so have I. I am the one who knows. <laughs> oh, okay. I am the know-it-all. I feel disconnected from fate's flow. <laughs> In other I words, I can't keep up with the zoomers. Save Tamriel. Save Tamriel or else the zoomers will take over. Oh, I had no idea that was Elder Scrolls. <laughs> And they're rounding up Omnix. <laughs> they need our help. Oh, wow. Over who? But I'm picking up reports of more attacks in other cities. I'm picking up that this is cringe. Fight, oh my god, new ways to play a YouTube video game? Get the YouTube out, man. Oh my god, co-op? And an Overwatch game? There's a firing range? Oh my god. Engaging. Yeah, I, I saw that. Yeah, I don't play like any Blizzard games. Whenever you don't play much Blizzard, from an outside perspective, it just seems like a YouTube hot mess. What? The YouTube. What is this place? It looks like we're in a palace. What the hell is going on? Who are these people? No idea. But if they're attacking us, our only choice is fighting back. Hey, look over there! YouTube. Persona 5 racing confirmed. And Persona 5 Can overcooked confirmed. So you're telling me you're thieves who steal hearts and you just happen to stumble into this world? The rebel oh. corps will always help the Phantom I'm sorry, Corps, new win music. The Phantom thieves have helped the rebel corps. Never forget that we're a united force who can rely on each other. You should be grateful to have been made my subjects. But you're just matterless little brats. <laughs> Unfortunately, oh. returning will be no easy feat. Somewhere deep inside, I know you realize things can't go on like this. So, will you take a stand beside us? Yeah, let's show them what we got. <laughs> YouTube tactics game. Oh my god. I'm sorry. I'm gonna be completely honest I barely watched like any of that trailer because I was so entranced by the music. The music was so goddamn good You're telling me like Persona 5 into tactics Excuse me Apple bottom jeans boots with the fur with the that's the art style Why does Morana's mouth look like that? Man, they're still going with the Persona 5 milk. Let's go and you know what? I still stand by what I said before. 
I don't care about Persona Milk at all because I keep getting more music and it's amazing every time. I don't give up. YouTube. I love well, tactics. It's my favorite genre. <laughs> In Persona 5. This is like Crystal's perfect combo of game. Are you kidding me? Why does this girl look like a mini sign Ijima? Wait, 11, 17. I didn't see the release date. Dude, what? That's five months. Excuse me? Show them what we got. Oh, that transition is so hot. Ah! Was it catchy in there at all? Thanks, I'm gonna cry now. Well, at least Lynn's singing it. Seriously, I feel like Atlas specifically made this game just for me. They definitely made it just for me. I am the only consumer uh, that clearly matters. They're like, you know what? Crystal, she's a person and she loves Persona and she loves tactics games. So we're going to make a game just for her. And I'm like, damn, that is so nice of you. That's actually crazy. Thank you so much. I love tactics. Very based, Atlas. But again, we'll discuss these trailers at the end. I kind of want to keep getting through the Humanity Xbox showcase here. Since apparently you. there's more announcements than I expected to be in this. The I'm offended. <laughs> I'm just like losing my mind because I cannot believe. I, like we're what? We're there are space things happening. I love this part. Oh my God, we're going to space. Wow. Spacer punk. Oui. Oh, the music is sure swelling again. Crazy. Oh, that's Starfield. That's like what they're gonna be showcasing for like the whole rest of it. That's an outfit. Oh, what's that on your back? It looks so cute. Where are your eyes? Oh my God, sweetie. My muscles hurt just watching. Oh, I don't know what that thing is, but it's so cute. It seems very exploratory. Very beautiful. And I love the swelling music. 10 out of 10 would swell again. That's sad. <laughs> don't worry, I'm never going to say that again. Jesus, this Xbox showcase is going YouTube hard. I'm actually impressed. Unlike the PlayStation state of play, where all they do is between every two to three trailers that you see, they have to show... I'm going to shut up. Because that was pretty. But yeah, so ev between every two to three trailers that the, that the PlayStation Showcase showed, they had to sh remind you of the PlayStation buttons. Xbox is just like, trailer, 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 man. Jeez. I'm not breathing between these trailers, which I like. I don't need to breathe. Breathing is overrated. Wow. I love this. Hello. Gameplay. Let's go. And a lot of it. Dane Dungeons of Hinterberg. I want to play that. Don't need to breathe, so it's breathtaking. I love all that. Hi. Oh. I'm very excited to be returning as Johnny Silverhand Hi. in the upcoming expansion <laughs> for Cyberpunk 2077, Keanu Phantom Liberty. Scared. This new adventure reunites Johnny and Dee on a dangerous <laughs> spy mission. And introduces Idris Elba. <laughs> it's really amazing when I just to share a screen with you, Idris. <laughs> it's cool to be a part of this game with you, man. That was legendary. Stories. Check it out. Check it out, man. Yeah. Does that mean I, I should it. finally play the first cyberpunk game? Someone like, the world up. that they create you know, is genuinely so cool. Like, I've, I've been interested in playing right. cyberpunk. Wherever she goes, people get hurt. It actually seems so unique and cool. Whoa, did that train just go through a roundabout? I, I probably... Why am I focusing on that? <laughs> I point out the stupidest shit. Oh my god! Zoo Tycoon, but city. Don't care, doesn't have animals. 
You think I want to build shit for people? The only thing I'm doing to build for people is Roller Coaster Tycoon. Now that's the shit. Roller Coaster Tycoon, the goaded anime game. <laughs> it might as well be an anime game. The goaded game of the whole ass century, okay? God, I played that game so much growing up, it was unhealthy. Did anybody else, whenever guests were unhappy with your park, you would just like drop them in the ocean? Oh, you're unhappy? You put them on a thumb gun and roller coaster that <gasps> I'm sorry. Is this another atlas? Wait, oh, okay, hold on. Ah! Okay. Oh wait, is this that game that they've been trying to release for like five centuries? Is that like Project Zero game or whatever? The music in the background is going unnecessarily hard. Holy shit. Ugh, why does that look so hot? The menus. Mm. Mm. This looks hot as YouTube. And it looks so incredibly anime. But I love it. Holy shit, this music! This music sure is swelling, alright. Oh, cat! Re fantasy in 2024. Okay, that trailer went so unnecessarily hard. Like the heavy opera in the background, the heavy visuals, like that trailer was honestly way too much. That was such an information overload. Holy, this genuinely looks good? I'm confused. That guy looked like you, Narakami. Atlas has been holding on to like genuinely big announcements for a long time. Persona 5 Tactics coming out in November. Persona 3 Remake would be coming out early 2024. And then this coming out, it just says in 2024, which every time a game company says this shit, you just always expect to be the very end, which tells me that if these are their next three big announcements with Atlas, Persona 6 is probably 2025. E. <laughs> it's okay, we still get games. Damn, three Atlas announcements, that's nuts! I expected a whole ass one! Like, Persona 3 Remake, that's all I was expecting out of today! You must explore this world. What if I don't wanna? To find the origins of this evil. But what if I like evil and I don't wanna destroy it? And bring hope back to our people but what if i don't like people what if i want them to be filled with despair you can save humanity no that looks very average cool transition is a miracle of progress what the hell i'm getting so many different vibes what time period is this <laughs> it's so futuristic but like Old England, I, I don't understand. Sherlock Holmes is about to YouTube. Show up in here. Sherlock Holmes with a gun. If you what I have built. Holy design, that is cool. There is no what is in this? Space or it's not, it doesn't feel like traditional steampunk though. Clockwork. Revolution. That looks really cool. Revolution. Honestly, I, like I'm not much of an Xbox person. How about is shaping up but why was this so much better than like any RPG other game announcements that Adam we've had City. for like several months? I, Avowed, I'm very confused. Why was this so good? It's not even just Star Atlas and like a Dragon Age. Like even the games that I wouldn't necessarily play got my attention. First look at this. Okay. Whoa! Oh, holy! They got a whole new cast. Okay, though. Okay, but like, Kagi is Akihiko. I think I can actually get behind. Allegra Clark as Mitsuru. Oh my god. 
Alex Lee? I'm not sure I know the others. Would you say you've been waiting for this? Um, I'm just very surprised. So they've officially like announced the English cast entirely. Oh, you know what? Okay, okay, okay. That's information to really let sink in for a sec. I, I honestly did not expect a full recast of everybody. I think it's actually cool though. I think I can get behind that. I love seeing a mix of new voice actors, old voice actors that we know. Like a, a good combo of both is fantastic. Oh, wait, I see an Alex Lee post and it says honored to join this beloved series and to be filling the shoes of my hero yuri lowenthal he hugged me and said i'm so happy for you that's so cute <laughs> but i see a johnny post hold up hold up a minute it's an honor to announce that i will be making <laughs> dog noises as the strongest member of C's. <laughs> fucking johnny good job johnny oh my god i'm so proud of you Oh, I guess I should look at the official website, huh? So you open the site, remember you will die, time never waits. That's just so Persona 3, isn't it? This is epic, holy shit. Oh my God, look at them. Yukari looking like a queen as usual. I could get behind that new Jupi- Oh, the rest, you only get three. This is all you get, nobody else. I really want to see Akihiko and Shinji. It's the only two I care about, just kidding. Oh, interview, producer, director, confirm that. Reload will not feature the additional content from Fest or Portable. So that's no FemC, no answer. So first I'd like to mention that since the basic concept of Persona 3 Remake was to remake the Persona 3, we don't have the Fest and Portable content included. We wanted to really genuinely work on recreating the Persona 3 experience. So the basic concept of recreating the Persona story was that we wanted to keep everything from the original version, but update everything to the modern day. So at the same level of Persona 5, basically. So we have the newest graphics, we have updated the system to the newest usability, we have the voice lines, and we also have the text available in 13 languages. So you should be able to have similar experiences to that of Persona 5. Definitely comes across. Like I got so much Persona 5 out of, out of everything in that trailer. Hmm. Oh man, I know this is gonna be a hot take. I'm not that mad. I don't know, like I'm not that bothered. Like, does it suck that there's no FMC? Yes. Do I think it's the end of the world and it's really that bad? No, I don't think so. With this kind of a statement, I can only respect it because like, if this is what the director and producer wanted, they're like, this is what we feel is the true story. But if this is what they want people to experience as Persona 3 and like what the canon thing is for people to experience, I think that's fine. Like if I didn't read this and somebody just told me that there's no FEMC and there's no answer, I would probably be mad. But reading an interview and reading what the producer and director specifically thought about it in their vision for the game, for me, makes me feel better because it's up to them at the end of the day. Like this is what they feel is their version of the game that they want to put out. And that's okay. Like it sucks, but that's okay. I will say I'm um, I'm a little bit more upset at the include non-inclusion of the answer. But again, I understand that it's okay. I genuinely feel like the answer closed a lot of loops that I had emotionally when playing Persona 3. And I felt like it completed the, the emotional journey that I had. I think like storytelling wise, you could leave Persona 3 open-ended. You don't need the answer, but it really did help give closure to me. Now, I don't think that it's completely off the table for it to be DLC. To me, this doesn't speak like it's not an impossibility, but overall, I'm not as upset as I think a lot of other people are probably going to be because of this. If this is what how they want to tell the story, this is how they want to tell the story. P3P and P3 Fest, it's kind of confusing between the two. You get two different experiences of the same story, but they're different experiences and the emotions that you take away out of both. Just because like FemC and Makoto are just like two very, very different characters. If they want something more streamlined, then that works. Persona fans be mad about everything. Well, I mean, it, it's understandable like to be upset whenever you are a big fan of a game that is ancient. <laughs> I say ancient. <laughs> Look, Persona 3 is ancient. I hate to break it to you. It's ancient and people are very attached to the game. So it's very clear that people are going to be upset. You cannot please everybody. I'm just very excited to see the other aspects of the game. It does seem like they're adding more content, which I didn't quite expect. God, this picture goes off so YouTube hard. Hello. 
I think this is my favorite picture. Jesus. It genuinely just goes off. That's a raw ass picture. I want this as my desktop background. Yesterday, dude. The memorable scenes are now more vivid than ever before. Hmm. Thanks. I think I'll just die. That's all I pretty much have to say about Persona 3 Remake. I'm not upset. I think I'm looking forward to it more than I was before. The new cast is dope as shit. I can get behind that. Persona 5 Tactic. Tactica. Tactica. Look at all those chickens. New character. Just Uno new character. I love the apple bottom jeans art. It's fantastic. Cute. This Ryuji face looks like he's trying to cringe or some shit. Who are they trying to fool? I know that they have to do that. Like they have to say that it's Xbox PC for marketing, but it's gonna be a Switch PlayStation. New music, scroll up. Wait, what? Shut the YouTube. What? Persona 3? No one cares! Question for you, I said, do you honestly just not care? I get the feeling for guys. Holy shit, can we get a round of applause for YouTube? Ping Lin. Question for you, I said, do you honestly just not care? I get the feeling that there's not that case for the face. Everyone has the right to go and see the other side, so break down the barricade before it. 